This last clip on how to tune in Melodyne, I'm going to show you how to bounce your tune file so that you get the desired result on a stereo mix to play in your CD player. So to do that, you basically still have everything set up the way it's been set up with Melodyne Bridge open in playback mode. You go in like you would bounce a file in Logic and set its start and end time. And basically, then you would just bounce the file as if it was a regular file. And the only thing with Melodyne being there is you have to make sure that you have when you're done the desired outcome because sometimes when bouncing to disk offline it's going to give you if you have to deal with one of the, those delays you may not have heard it because you're not listening but then after the fact you notice that your third verse comes in a bar late and is out of time so the main thing with Melodyne and tuning with the host program is really you know, and bouncing files is really just to make sure that before you take your bounce files and send them somewhere or do any sort of work with them is that they are really what you desire and they are really how you want them. It will, bouncing out of the third party program will follow the transport line all the way through Melodyne and get all the change notes, everything, it will do it all on its own. You just need to make sure that when it's finished product, it's really what you want to have.